Hey everyone, this is my new Samsung 4K Ultra HD TV. It's a 58 inch model uh, from the 7 series and the 7 series uh, stands for a uh, budget line. So let's take a look. Brands such as uh, TCL and Hisense offer uh, similar size TVs for around $400, but I was surprised to see um, uh, Samsung going for uh, just uh, $350. Okay, let's start unpacking. I will be surprised if they include uh, any HDMI cable for this price range. So let's take a look. Okay, quick setup guide. Stand. Remote. There is one more stand. Here. So two stands and a remote. So super thin. Okay, so the box should just slide. There's our TV. So this model has uh, three HDMI and two USB and old school component inputs. The key thing is uh, Ethernet. So if you're going 4K, I would highly recommend uh, hardwiring it. So I'm gonna wall mount this TV and Samsung provided the adapters that goes uh, here. And uh, the adapter comes with the TV, but the screws, M8 screws, they don't. So you need to pay, uh, you need to buy that separate for uh, five bucks. And it doesn't cost much, but why not just throw four screws along with the TV? Anyway, let's move on. So before you wall mount your TV, make sure that your existing cables support uh, 4K. So this HDMI cable, I don't know how old it is. Um, it does say, uh, let me focus. Uh, there you go, high speed HDMI cable. So by uh, default, high speed HDMI cable should support 4K. I have no idea what brand this one is. Uh, it's probably one of those uh, uh, mono price uh, cables. Almost ready, just need to mount it. Okay, TV is mounted. Let's uh, turn the TV on. And uh, this particular model does not come with the uh, Samsung One remote, but rather a standard remote. Uh, no compliance as this is a budget line. Welcome. Please download the SmartThings app on your mobile to start TV setup. Okay, let's go through the setup process and finish it. Highly recommend uh, uh, Ethernet connection if you want to stream uh, 4K content. Agree to all. Okay, enter my uh, Samsung account. And I don't want to back up anything. Zip code, I guess, for uh, weather as well as uh, media guide. And all done. Let's go through the settings quickly. So I'm gonna go to the gear icon or uh, TV manuals here. And here you can toggle through the settings quickly. or leave it to standard. Uh, again, sound mode, TV speaker. If you wanna adjust them individually, you can go back to the settings and go to the settings screen. Picture, expert setting. Uh, brightness has a different scale, uh, 0 to 5, compared to the rest. As you go through the settings, there is a brief note on the side on what each setting does, so it's pretty helpful, and you're not adjusting uh, something without knowing what you're doing. Sound mode, same uh, expert, equalizer if you want to do it, I'll do it later. Another thing I like is the built-in uh, DLNA support. So if you click on source, uh, here is my uh, home theater that I have hooked up to my receiver. And uh, 
my Chromecast and uh, that's my NAS so it has built in uh, DLNA uh, it can uh, connect your NAS or if you have your media connected through the hard disk that works too so that's pretty good exit and uh, Samsung uh, let's open the media guide here are your uh, free movies free TV shows so if you are new to smart TV then there is a lot of free content available I'll go back yes and Samsung TV plus again you have a bunch of free TV channels so if you want to remove some of the shortcuts at the bottom it's pretty easy you just go let's say I don't want uh, voodoo so just down click and uh, remove yes remove let's go back so let's talk about the picture quality this particular clip is uh, shot on 2K, but it really looks amazing on this TV. I'm not sure how much my camera can capture, but it's pretty sharp. If you're new to 4K, uh, trust me, you will not go back to uh, 1080p uh, uh, TVs anymore. This is a lot of TV for uh, 350 bucks, and if you're in the market for a new TV or a secondary TV, and if you have a tight budget, uh, I would recommend check this one out. This particular audio series, the budget line is pretty uh, impressive for the price and I'm sure you won't uh, be disappointed. Thanks for watching.